When it's time to freshen up the look of your kitchen, changing the cabinet color can make all the difference. This kitchen has good bones, but it's desperately in need of a makeover. Typically, when repainting cabinets, you would need to take the cabinet doors off. But because we're using Beyond Paint and there isn't any prep, we're actually just going to keep them on. With Beyond Paint, updating old cabinets is not only easy, but it's cost effective too, saving both time and money. We've decided to go with a black and white color scheme for this kitchen. Beyond Paint's licorice is the perfect shade for the space. Before beginning, we make sure that the surface is clean and free of any wax, oil, dirt, and grease. It's best to use a household degreaser before painting. Pay extra attention to the area where the door meets the frame. This spot is the most often touched and can be easy to miss when cleaning. Once the cabinets are clean and dry, we can grab the roller and get to work. Beyond Paint is thicker than normal paint. One quart covers 50 square feet with two coats. That's 10 to 12 cabinet fronts and face frames. We will mostly be using a roller today, but Beyond Paint can also be applied with an HVLP wide nozzle sprayer. Here, we use a small brush to stifle in areas that are harder to roll, but we will roll as much as possible for a nice, even finish. After the first coat is applied, we allow two to four hours before applying the second coat. Allow at least seven days for the paint to fully bond and up to 30 days before it's fully cured. Only a couple of hours after the second coat is applied and the surface is beautiful and dry to the touch. And the final result? Proof you no longer need to feel anxious about tackling that cabinet project. No stripping, sanding, or priming required. You don't even have to take the doors off to get durable, professional results using Beyond Paint. For paint for all your home projects, visit beyondpaint.com.